everything that you do in a startup is an experiment. When you have an amorphous idea, um, it can change. And if you talk to someone who doesn't want your product, you can say, oh, they just weren't my customer. But when you write down a specific statement like, I believe this customer segment has a problem with this problem, every hypothesis, every idea is based on a set of assumptions that you have about how the world works. What you need to do is document those assumptions and figure out what is the reason why this hypothesis could fail. There are three methods that you can use to learn if what you're building is what customers actually want. There are specific techniques for how you interview people to find out if they have a problem and if the behaviors that they're exhibiting indicate you could have a successful business. You don't have to have a product to sell a product, but pre-selling a product before it exists can help you realize that there's actually demand for what you want to do. The third method is what we call concierge. This is when you're developing one version of the product to sell it to a single customer. Does this product live up to the expectations of my customer? Are they happy with it? What do we need to change about this product before we mass produce it to millions of people and ship it all over the world? Where does success lie for our experiment? This is a personal team decision based on your beliefs about why this is a good idea in the first place.